told you before. No one walks away from me. Go see your father, see if he wants you. Same goes for you. Where was you all night? Mates. Yeah? You think you got out of it all, do you? Well, we ain't brought any of your stuff. All your nasty dragon. Well, you left Rooney. <laughs> Rooney's upstairs, we brought him. Yeah, I would have served you right if we hadn't brought him. No. That creepy thing always staring at yeah? me. Yeah, we should you leave you in be. the old flat. Yeah, come here and say that. Get here. Well, it's more, he did a few months back. Oh, hang on. You're Denise Fox. Yeah, I read about you in the paper. You're the one who smacked Mark Keegan. That is what I wanted to talk to you about. You cut his face. Look, I'm not proud of what I did, but I was provoked, OK? I'm not here to pick a fight. I just saw that you moved in yesterday, and if we're going to be neighbours, I don't want any trouble. No, of course you don't. You've got a record now, haven't you? <laughs> well, don't we all? Look. I know our Markeegan can get some time, so if you say you were uh, provoked, then, well, I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But the next time you lay a finger on him, I'll knock you straight out. Understood? Hi! You talking to me? Where is he? Who? Your husband? Talk about reputation, eh? <laughs> Your son! Where is he? Which one? The one that raped my stepdaughter. Uh, which one's yours? Cos neither of them look that innocent. What? The police have been round my house taking statements. Mm. That's why they were here, yeah? I saw the car. We only moved in yesterday. You got the wrong family. Keegan? He's in the same year as Louise? Is he upstairs? Cos I doubt he's in school, You've is got he? your facts wrong, love. My sons ain't rapists. He spiked her drink, took her upstairs and forced himself on her. That is rape! Spike her drink? Now I know you've got the wrong lad. Mark Keegan wouldn't do that. He doesn't have to. He can get any girl he wants. Nah, she's just crying rape because you found out. <laughs> I've known girls like her. What, you think rape's a joke, dear? Who are you, her minder? Why aren't you neck in? You don't care, dear. You know, why am I surprised? One look at you and it's obvious why he is like he is. He has been causing trouble around here for months. Well, this time he's gone too far. He's going to be locked up where he belongs. With all the other animals. <laughs> Go on, have a go at me! Oh. Go on, I'll hit you so hard, you won't be able to get up! What do you want? Karen Taylor, I'm arresting you on suspicion of cold Oh, assault. come on! I hardly touched her! Get off me! No, I've got my daughter to look after, and my boys need picking up from school! Evidence. Do you understand? Find Chantel to pick up the boys. I know they can come. Bernie, come with me! You call that assault? Wait till I lay my hands on you next time! <laughs> That's not a threat! That's a promise! He admit it. Louise, I'm so sorry. He was trying to impress the older boys. Seems like I ain't the only bad parent in the room. Don't you dare put us on the same level. <sighs> Denny is a ten-year-old boy. He made a mistake, but him, he should know better. Lying about sleeping with someone, that is disgusting. Oi. Totally disgusting, and that is down to you and the way you raised yeah, him. Oh, oh, just be quiet! Bernadette, that better not be you. It's me. sent me home. Oh, what happened? It looks worse than it is. Uh, leave that a minute. I, I want to change. I'm meeting someone. No, in a minute. I need to talk to you. I've wanted to talk to you since Friday, but, you know, what with your work and all that? What? Sit down. Has something happened? No, I just want to talk. About what? Listen, when... When you're a mum, you... You notice things, yeah, and you... Sometimes you need to ask stuff that you really don't want to ask, you but you... want me to move out, didn't you? Because oh. there's no room. No, no, love, this is your own. What are you talking about, then? Well, it's... No, just... just forget it. What? No, just say it, whatever it is, I don't care. You haven't... You haven't got your sister pregnant, have you? Because I heard you talking Friday and you were talking about secrets and and it's been going over and over in my head. What and kind and of if sick, you were, twisted mind. If this happens... Between sickos? Yeah, well, you two. You know, you're always together, secretly chatting, and you... Well, you, you clam up whenever you see me. Can you hear what you're saying? She's my sister. How could you think? Well, yeah, because I have to think. Because I'm your mother and whatever you say, you don't... Know, these things happen, and if it's true, then well, I need to Of course it's not true! You honestly think I could do that? 
To my sister! To my 15 year old sister! That's what you think of me. Have a nice little kip, did ya? No, you ain't going anywhere. Oh, eh? She wants a slap. Oh. Yeah? Oh, you yeah. have to come through me first, Wayne. Oh, Who are you oh, talking oh, to? Oh, get out of my face! Oh, yeah. I've got a little treat for you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I bet you won't be able to believe your eyes. <laughs> Hello, Mitch. There you go. Feast your eyes on us para mugs for getting mixed up with you. Believe me, I know what it's like when everyone hates you. Should have seen the reaction when we moved in. Yeah, I can guess. Still, I never threw anyone over a table. Sorry about that. It's all right. I'll get you for it one day, don't you worry. Here, that's private property. These machines have seen worse than a bit of chewing gum. It's my job to keep them in good working order. That's clean and tidy. Oh, yeah, darling. Give me a call. I'll have all your dirty bits sparkling. I might even iron your smalls for you, if you like. Uh, if anyone's ironing his smalls, it's going to be me. Well, let's ask him who he prefers, shall we? Oh, I never had you down as a backstabber. I helped you out yesterday. You don't own elbow grease. No, I don't. And even if I scrubbed you all day, you'd still stink. You chair. Tell me, I yes. stink. I'm going to stay here. You you're filthy. Shut up, you old tar. Go on. brush your oh, ears. Shut up, you cow. All right. Yeah? Famous last words. Yeah, you better do one. Yeah, I think I owe you a thank you. See, Sharon, that's your problem. You're stuck in the past. We're moving on, ain't we, Karen? Yeah. I mean, since your lot turned up, we ain't bottom of the pile no more. I've never felt so popular. <laughs> Time for that, love. I want a word with you. That your dog, is it? You heard about Joyce not having a funeral? What do you want about? Joyce, the old bird who lives beneath me. Her husband can't even afford to bury her. She ain't even getting a funeral. And there's you, pretending to be brown bread, conning everyone, fleecing for money. I'll change the record, will ya? It weren't my idea. Oh, yeah, you was in on it. I know about your sort, yeah? And what sort's that, then? Con artists, the lot of ya. <laughs> Hot calling kettle. <laughs> Poor old bloke like Ted. Been married for 60 years. He can't even see his wife putting a hole through a curtain. It ain't right. Then right to your MP. It's nothing to do with me. Scum! That's all you are. Get that thing on her lead. And whilst you're at it, get yourself a muzzle! 